In this video, you will see the key differences between working with the 3D design software and ARCHICAD. You will see the comparison including uses at different project phases and then going more technical about the differences of components versus favorites, layers and filters, visualization, element metadata for documentation, publishing and file formats. Just a reminder that this is not a full comparison including every detail, but is only focusing on the most important aspects of the two solutions. The common practice in the industry is the usage of different software in each project stage. 3D design software comes into place at the creative phase of the project, when exploration of mass happens because of its flexibility and easy handling. Although after that comes the usage of 2D CAD applications, as the 3D design software lacks the ability to create precise and detailed documentation during the design development phase and its following stages. On the other hand, ARCHICAD can be your tool for pre-design stage as well. You can work with the same software from start to finish, so you can save time because there is no need to export and remake your design in a 2D drawings. You don't have to create a separate 2D CAD drawing as your design documents are generated from the central ARCHICAD model. Now let's look at some more specific technical differences and similarities. Components is one of the key features of a 3D design software. It is a group of entities such as edge, forms and faces that could be instanced and reused multiple times within a model. If you change anything from the component model, Every placed instance of that component will be updated automatically, saving time. ARCHICAD, on the other hand, has a method called favorites. You can save a favorite of any element and apply the same settings for 3D objects. It can be done to more identical elements simultaneously by using filtering or different selection methods, such as the find and select option. It will select all elements that fulfill the criteria and you can apply a specific favorite to all these elements in one go. With ARCHICAD comes an extensive library as well, including 2D symbols that you can use for documentation, for example. Now let's talk about layers and filters. Layers is a setting you use for controlling the visibility of the contents of your model. Although both have identical features, such as locking or turning the visibility on or off, Layers in ARCHICAD offer more advanced features, allowing users to have folders, layer extensions, and intersection priority. These layer settings will affect the way 3D elements behave within the modeling space. With ARCHICAD, you can also set up layer combinations. You can apply layer combinations to predefined views of the same viewpoint. This way, you can create documents for different purposes easily. Aside from that, ARCHICAD offers filters such as showing load-bearing elements only, showing existing, new and demolished elements with the renovation filter, and there are many more ways to define how the model is represented in your final documentation.